War is breaking out between the two towns who lay claim to Dad's army. Well, we've got Thetford in Norfolk, the home of a fictional Warmington-on-Sea, where the TV series was filmed. I love this music. It's launched a full-on attack on Bridlington, where the big screen version has been filmed. At the moment, we reckon the front line's somewhere over Market Raisin. Our reporter, Michael Billington, has more. You may be forgiven for thinking that Bridlington Old Town is suffering something of an identity crisis, but these are of course what's left over from when Hollywood film producers came to town to make the new big screen version of Dad's Army. He's been on the run, he'll be tired and hungry. If you won't come quietly, you know what to do. There he is, sir. The film's out in February, and now the town's hoping for a permanent reminder of its time in front of the cameras by twinning with the film's fictional setting, Warmington-on-Sea. We've got a magic mix here where the big stars were, and that's why we want it to come to Bridlington, the big stars of the film that's going out to the cinemas in February. That's why we've, we've laid our claim and indeed came up with the idea. But since announcing its plans, Bridlington's become the target of an all-out assault, a declaration of war from Thetford in Norfolk, the original location for the BBC series. I tweeted the mayor of Bridlington on Saturday morning saying pistols at dawn at Warmington, question mark. So we've had a light-hearted exchange of views, but um, he does claim that Yorkshire is God's own county, and as we all know, in Norfolk, Nelson was born here, is obviously God's county here. Well, yes, Warmington on the Thetford on nowhere near the sea. We could fight them on the beaches, but they don't have a beach, do they? The link to Dad's army is good for tourism. Thetford boasts a museum dedicated to the series, while in Brid they say bookings have more than doubled since news of the film was announced. Heather Alexander runs a vintage shop in the town. Since the filming, it has been a lot busier and we do need this up here. We've done all the hard work, you know, it, it was most enjoyable but hard work for all the residents, shop owners up here and we all mucked in and it, it was a great town so now it's our glory. <laughs> And stars of the latest big screen adaptation have weighed in as well. Cyril Marsberg plays the mayor of Warmington-on-Sea. Well, I think they've got the hump, and quite rightly so, but they should have jumped on the bandwagon several years ago, really. Uh, this is the new future. It's a wonderful location, actually, and uh, I should imagine all the, my residents from Warmington-on-Sea will come and holiday here. Despite claims from Thetford that Brid is trying to steal its thunder, the East Yorkshire town's determined that its connection to Dad's army lives on in movie history, rather than being left on the cutting room floor. Oh, yay! Bridlington Old Town forever will be linked with Dad's army and twinned with Warmington on sea. God save the Queen! Michael Billington, ITV News in Bridlington. That's brilliant, isn't it? We'll love a bit of that. You one, can't argue you? with that. You can't. You? There's <laughs> no arguing. There's no arguing. And thank you to um, certain John Mitchell for making our wonderful map beforehand. Oh, yeah. Very proud of that map. He's very proud of it. Mm. Here he is with his weapon.